Well, Wells Fargo has been very instrumental in helping us with funding for this program. They um, gave the incubator uh, $10,000 this year from the Wachovia Wells Fargo Foundation, and we were able to put about half of that toward the cash prize for the competition. And I wanted to introduce you to a woman who um, is, uh, you, uh, I, can't, I can't remember your title, so you're gonna have to tell them. But I first met this woman um, at the Tri-County Economic Development uh, program about a year and a half ago, and she was on the arm of a oh, very old friend of ours uh, from the Silicon Valley World Internet Center, Mr. Chuck Boggs. And so I got to meet Sue and um, become a friend. So I'd like you to all um, welcome uh, Sue Lewis from Wells Fargo. Okay, so we have to clarify a couple of things. First of all, I think he was on my arm, <laughs> but I'm not quite sure. Uh, thank you, Susan. Um, my title is, I'm the Community Bank President for Wells Fargo Bank in Monterey and Santa Cruz. Uh, so we were very pleased to be able to participate and sponsor uh, and work with the Marina Technology Cluster and sponsor today's event. And how exciting for the 12 finalists. So I'm sure that everyone's raring to go. I do want to just take a minute because I was thinking uh, last night that um, I would have this opportunity to get up in front of everybody and I thought, okay, how am I going to make this relevant to the entrepreneurs in the audience? And so I thought, um, I thought a little bit about it and I thought, well, let's think about the history of Wells Fargo because our history is long and rich, as many of you I'm sure know, we're a California bank, However, our history started way back in New York with two entrepreneurs by the name of, last names of Wells and Fargo. And they decided um, to, they were very entrepreneurial and filled a niche that they saw uh, because the postal industry at the time, the post office, the government, um, it took 54 days to get a letter from San Francisco to New York. <coughs> So that they thought, hmm, that's not very efficient, and communication needs to be much quicker. So they owned a, um, an express company, Pony Express Company, back in New York. So really, Wells Fargo was founded on uh, being an express company and delivering um, communication and mail. And it then, I don't know, morphed into um, and filling another need, which was through the California Gold Rush and uh, banking needs of local people. And so it's really flash forward 158 years. And here we are today um, still meeting the needs of our customers and entrepreneurs are really important to the communities in which we serve and the economic development. It fuel, you know that um, entrepreneurs fuel the economic development in our local communities. And so we, uh, may be considered a big bank, but we're really a community-based bank that meets the needs of our customers, and we would love every single one of you to walk through our doors and bank with us, because <laughs> that's a little commercial. Um, because really what we do is we help our business owners understand what we can do to help them grow. And I think together it's a great partnership. So I'm really pleased to be able to sponsor this event today and to partner with the Marina Technology Cluster. I wish the finalists very good luck today, and um, thank you. <laughs>